getting a really freaking weird vibe from this thing. Like it just, it's like staring me in the dead in my soul. She actually like collects it from people who are like tormented by these objects. And she said you not open the boxes. Tiger print. Oh. It looks like freaking teeth. There's, there's teeth in here. I'm not even. Yo YouTube, what's up? It's your boy Justin, back at you guys with a new video. And guys, so recently I ordered off of eBay a haunted mystery box. So supposedly it's supposed to have like a few like objects or something that are possessed by like a spirit. So yeah, uh, this might be really dumb to do. I, I don't know, man. Don't know if it's real. So I guess we're just gonna have to find out and unbox it. But before we get started, make sure you guys uh, drop a like, subscribe if you haven't already below. And uh, yeah, this Let's get into it. All right guys, so the box that it actually came in kind of looks like this. It's like a really like freaking torn up box, okay? So I'm gonna open the first thing. Oh, so the first thing in here guys is actually a freaking, it's a doll. I don't know if it's just cause like, it's supposed to be haunted. But like I'm getting a really freaking weird vibe from this thing. Like it just, it's like staring me in dead in my soul. Like, look at this thing. Like, I, I guess it's possessed. And keep in mind, guys, like, this is all stuff from, like, some random person off of eBay. So, like, um, yeah, I don't know what is all going to be in here. All right, so the next thing is in this little pouch, this little red pouch, okay? And, oh, she, she wrapped, or whoever sent this. And all has this. I don't know what that means. Like, if this is, like, a symbol of something. Like, I'm kind of nervous, like, to freaking open this. Like, like, it's just, like, it's, like, squishy. Okay, so, it's something... I don't know if you guys can see, guys. There's, like, a little, like, face and, like, some sort of rocks. So, like, if you guys know, like, what any of this stuff means, like, if it's, like, a freaking, like, demon symbol, just, uh, let me know. We got a little small package. But, you know, sometimes the small packages. All right, so on here we have another one of those things. And this is actually some sort of neck. I think it's a necklace because there's like a little chain with it. So I don't really know what that means. I feel like I'm showing you guys like freaking like devil stuff. Like, I feel like I have no idea. It's freaking like black freaking black little stones or something. Okay, so on this little thing in here, there's like this little necklace chain thing attached. Actually, I, I don't know because like this isn't actually a necklace. It's just a chain with like this little rock on it. So that's kind of that's kind of interesting. In the flat thing, this, this is like it kind of feels like wood maybe. Or like oh, guys, we got this freaking whoever sent this literally came in clutch. They got me my own Ouija board. Freaking oh wait. It's a pendulum board. Um, looks like an Ouija board. Not really sure exactly. Uh, I, I feel like this is, like, I don't know. I feel like these like are the same as an Ouija board maybe. I don't know, it has like a little freaking star on it though. So you guys see that, yeah. You know, you know if we get like 10,000 likes, I'll uh, contact uh, whatever these possess objects are on the board thumbnail. All right, next, so we got, is this like a book? Oh, no way, she came in clutch with like a spell book. Yo, this is whack, bro. This is like, I think this is like an old, it's freaking Velcro, I think it's like an old diary. Oh. Okay. Guys, so this book actually explains what all this is. So it says, dear purchaser, this is a long explanation of the origins of each of the haunted objects sent to you. Please handle carefully. These objects are uh, a responsibility must be respected. I am a witch out of the Appalachian Mountains. Respect, care, responsibility. Okay, this is actually very long. Yo, this is freaking whack. Yo, okay, so this little board apparently was handmade by teenagers. And so I guess this girl, the girl who actually does like the haunted stuff, she actually like, collects it from people who are like tormented by these objects, which is freaking, that's insane. So it says, 
that this board, like they were haunted by a masculine something would stalk them and ambush them. Yo, I'm... Did you guys hear that? Guys, like, I'm actually, like, a little nervous right now because, like, I think I just ordered, like, some next level shit. Like, literally, like, this has, like, like, pages of pages of, like, what all this means. Yo, so at the very end, it says, like, nothing can hurt you if you don't empower them. So I don't know what exactly that means. So at the end, it has, like, like these little rocks in it. It says, blessed be and good luck. Good luck, guys. What the fuck did, what did I buy? I'm just gonna open some of this stuff and like kind of try to give you guys the backstory. Like I literally just, got, I, like I have the chills right now. Literally, like, I had friends freaking warn me like, bro, don't do it. Like, don't order a haunted mystery box. I did it anyway for the clout, you know, for the views. But like, this might not have been a good idea. Yo, what? I feel like, oh my god, dude. I feel like you like fucking look into this and something. Dude, I don't even want to look at this. It's like a black mirror and then Raven Afterworld. I don't know what this says. That's like a wax symbol. I feel like that's the devil. I don't know, dude. So next thing we have a little box and it has literally the, fuck, the star on it, of course. Inside we have, yo, actually, Yo, okay, actually it says, I think it says, do not open that box. Okay, so this mirror, this mirror, the lady said, this mirror even frightens me. She had a combo with a man, and he had some metaphysical phenomenon concerning his newly acquired mirror. So he wanted it gone and he removed it. Please be careful, do not break. Breaking could release something terrible. So apparently this witch took this mirror and like it like completely like disrupted her apparently and so she decided to pass along to me um thank you if you're watching this we're just gonna keep going because there's there's literally so many like i ordered like the small version like I, there was a big and a small or the small and there's like freaking like 10 things in here all right next we have like a quilt i'm gonna find the story on this real quick because like this is kind of random i feel like you'd easily just pick this up from your couch but it's probably like freaking connecting to me as we speak. This is actually insane. It says, that blanket, a child disappeared and is dead. And their parents donated the bedding and claims that a child ghost had been in the building, like where, like by the bedding. Wait, that bedding apparently supposedly is haunted by like a little girl, I think. Okay guys, I actually, so I found the backstory on the doll. Apparently she found her somewhere and this necklace, if you guys can see, apparently the necklace is what actually, apparently it's a kind doll. So thank you for being kind, like bless up. It's a kind doll. Apparently if you take off the necklace, well, she says do not take the necklace off at all costs. And she doesn't say what happens if you take it off. So I'm just not even gonna mess with it, dude. I'm just gonna, just, um, please, please don't hurt me. There's two more packages, so this last one, I think it's another one of those little boxes. And she said do not open the boxes. And this one has a little tiger print. Oh. Okay, well, I'm just gonna close this because there's something whack in here. I don't know what this is. It looks like freaking teeth. There's there's teeth in here. I'm not even. Okay, I, I literally have to chill. It's freaking close. Please, God, close. Okay, I, I'm gonna. It literally said, like, don't open the small boxes. So, that is tough. Um, okay. So this is the last thing, it's a little like scroll, I think. Like honestly, like, I don't even know why I'm so opening this stuff. Cause like, it's like, this is actually legit. Like this girl, like, like she freaking has like the freaking devil stars or whatever they are, I don't know. Yo, I read about this candle. This, this is a candle and I, here, I'll tell you guys a story on this candle. Cause it was in the freaking book. 
Guys, okay, hold up, hold that thought. I swear, this, I literally set this doll on its side and it's like face up right now. I got, no, guys, I'm not even joking you. You know me, you know that like I'm kind of like, I joke around with this stuff. Like, I'm like, oh, like it's not real. Like, like I'm actually like kind of like freaking shaking right now, dude. Like a little bit, like it's freaking, I'm actually like a little nervous. Like I usually don't get nervous about this stuff. All I'm thinking about right now is the freaking Annabelle movie. Why'd she have to send a doll? Like all the other stuff, like it's creepy. Yo, I thought I lost the board. Anyway, all the other, like this is creepy, right? Like, and this is supposed to be like the most, one of the most dangerous things out of all this. It's like it has like a evil spirit connected, but like a doll just that, that's like what gets me guys. Okay, anyway, so this says that you can hear whenever you have the candle in your room at night, you can lightly hear like a baby crying in the background, okay? Because apparently like a mother had this in her child's room or something. And it says that you must keep it in a white cloth at all times. I don't really have a white cloth, so I'm just gonna rip me, I guess. Like, I don't know. It was used for a chris, 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 christening. I think that's like holy, right? So this should be like good, hopefully. I don't Honestly guys, like, I don't even hear anything in this. But like, apparently it says like, a spirit is held in here. I think that's what it says. And it has like the star on it or is it pentagram? It has a pentagram on it, and I do not want to open this. But guys, all these objects, like, apparently, like, they're legit, like, haunted, and if you guys would like, I would be willing, I have an Ouija board, I would be willing to, or use this thing, if that's what this is for, I'm not really quite too sure, I think it is, I'd be willing to play this or my Ouija board, and I'd be willing to try to contact the spirits connected to all these objects. Straight out, so apparently this wooden box, she was doing like a ritual in the woods with her friends. Like, come on. Anyway, so apparently this appeared on the hood of her car while she was doing the ritual, and it says like, this is like human teeth maybe. Like, possibly. Guys, that, why are they selling this on eBay? Like, this does not seem like a thing you sell on eBay. Like, this freaking stone keeps falling. I feel like this is like bad, like I'm touching this right now. But like I said, guys, if you want, I will do it. This is supposed to be like the like most uh, um, evil thing out of all of it. Like it scared the freaking witch lady. Um, so yeah, leave a like on this video, subscribe. Um, I'm getting like a super. Yo, my camera literally just randomly stopped recording whenever I held this up. That is whack. Never happened before. Um, anyway, yeah, if you guys want to see that, I'm gonna try to find a friend to do it with me. But um, see you guys later. Bye.